Hello, good morning and welcome. This morning we are going to make homemade fried plantain chips. Plantains you can purchase at the supermarket or at your local grocery store. First you skin the plantains and you can use any amount, it's up to you. After you could chop the plantain into little pieces just like I did, as you can see right here. After you want to wash the plantain, then you, then you place them on a piece of paper towel or a dish cloth. Then you place your frying pan on the stove to get hot. When the frying pan is hot enough, you add some oil to them using vegetable oil, but you could use any oil you want, it's up to you, as long as it's oil. When the hot oil is well hot, you place your plantain into the frying pan and let it fry on one side you will know that one side is fried so the sides of your plantain is supposed to be just like this that's how you know it's ready for flipping over so you flip it onto the other side until the other side looks just like this so you flip them over to the other side so both sides just flip. Just flip it over like this. And when both sides are done, then let me see the next step. So now that the plantain is fried on both sides, you take it out of the frying pan and you load it onto a plate. Now you wanna, f you wanna flatten the plantain, so you need paper towel or a piece of cloth, a can or a wrong cup, a cup with a wrong bottom. The next step you get a plate and tissue paper or foil paper, you double the tissue paper. Put the plantain and the tissue paper put it over like this put it like this and you could use the cup or the can and you just press it out like this you flatten it up so it comes out flat like this Make sure you flatten the plantain pieces. Now that all the pieces are flattened, it's time to put it back into the oil to refry again. Place the pieces, the flattened pieces, back into the frying pan, fry it on one side. Flip the pieces over and fry the other side. And now that they are fully cooked, you place them on a piece of tissue paper on a plate or a bowl so that the tissue paper could suck up excess oil. At the end you season with salt, any kind of salt will do. When everything is fried up you sprinkle some salt and black pepper, that's it. Any kind of salt or black pepper and it's ready to serve. So this is the final. You could place it on tissue paper, but, but it's optional. The tissue paper is to drink up the excess oil, and then you sprinkle with a little salt and the black paper. Not so much. Thank you for watching, and hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe, like, and share this video. And if you do try this recipe, please let me know how it turned out. As you could do this for a snack or breakfast.